talking to us, Alex. Oh, you're welcome. Uh, what's your favorite subject in school? Oh, favorite subject in school? I'd probably say, uh, although it's my hardest class, chemistry, chemistry 2. I mean, chemistry 2 AP, so yeah, that's probably my favorite. All right. Do you have a favorite professional athlete? Uh, yeah. Um, I'm going to have to say um, Ronnie Lott of the 49ers, old, old uh, defensive back. Yeah. Who's your best friend on the team? Uh, Don McCracken. What's the last good movie you saw? Last good movie? Oh, gosh. I saw Road to Perdition um, with, my, with my father. It wasn't in the, wasn't in the movies, but at home. Yeah, what, Road what, was, to what was good about it? Uh, just, just a lot of, a lot of action and um, just kind of a, a subject I was unfamiliar with, like Irish mobs and, and stuff like that. So I, I kind of like that stuff. So it was good. What's something people don't know, wouldn't expect to know about your coach? About my coach, um, he is an avid uh, Game of Thrones watcher. He he watches Game of Thrones very often, and he, he loves it. I don't I don't know why. I mean, it's just it's very strange for him to like something like that, but he does. Uh, what song gets the most play on your iPod? Most play on my iPod. Uh, I probably say "See You in My Nightmares" by Kanye West and uh, Lil Wayne. If you're superstitious, is there something you do before every game or on game day? Uh, yeah, I um. Always get dressed left to right. So left sock, left sock, right sock, left. So left leg always goes in first before my before my right leg. When I put on my pants, left shoulder first gets buckled, right shoulder, and then um, and then left glove, right glove. So what's your favorite thing about football? For, um, the the intensity and uh, the people in the stands. I uh, can't beat it. Friday night under the lights, and it's uh, it's a family experience with the team and with the guys. It's it's really special. What's your least favorite thing about practice? Ah, uh, least favorite thing about practice? Um, probably conditioning. <laughs> uh, up downs and uh, Indian sprints, definitely, yeah. Have you thought about playing football after high school? Uh, yeah, I've thought about it. I, uh, I went to a Wesleyan football showcase, uh, so they took, took a look at me. I'm still in contact with them, so hopefully, hopefully that goes well, and if, if not, then and then maybe another school will come along, but I, I'm hoping so. What makes you start playing football? Uh, well, my father, um, I actually, I didn't play until sophomore year. That was my first year playing organized football because uh, I was always a hockey player growing up, and so I never had time to play Coventry Rams or anything. So, um, but, I, so and, but I've always been around the game with my dad coaching and stuff. So sophomore year, when he came back, uh, then then I, I had to play. I had to play. Actually, he's done a great hockey season. Oh, thanks, well. thanks. Fantastic. Um, what advice would you give to somebody who's just starting out on the team? Just starting out, um, nothing is going to be given to you. So always go 100%, 100 miles an hour, and always give it your all, no matter if, even if it's less than somebody ahead of you, ahead of you, because guys, guys who have heart play. And what goal would you like to reach? Football that you haven't yet reached. Um. Probably make it to the state championship. Um, make it to the state championship and win. I mean, that's that's what all these guys want, and and winning is winning is the top priority. And what's your proudest moment as a player? Proudest moment as a player, probably um, my first interception against Shea sophomore year. Um, that was that was a very special moment for me, and I and I got I gained a lot of respect with the older football players on on that day. So that, probably my first interception against Shea. Oh, thanks for speaking to us, Alex. Have oh, a great welcome. season. Yep, you too. Thank you.